Hi, it's Roberto Mickey, and we're going to be showing some data on some testing that we did for a 3M mask adapter for a ventilator filter that we found on YouTube. It was from a channel by Rsave, and he basically posted on Thingiverse how to make this device. And basically, we went to Thingiverse, downloaded it, and then printed it on ABS on our Up Mini printer. Here are some static photos of the cap and of the adapter. But under normal circumstances, I do not like to print these adapters with ABS because that kind of monofilament on a monofilament printer will lead to theoretically some micro pores, which may allow air to pass through the walls of this adapter. And this is a link to our previous YouTube video demonstrating the perils of monofilament 3D printing. For this video, out of convenience, we did on the ABS monofilament printer. But I think if you're going to do this in real life, that you should do this with a different type of technology for 3D printing. Or if you're going to use a monofilament printer, use a sealant. So to actually show that a sealant will improve the performance of this adapter, we compared the naked adapter and plug and compared it to a sealed one with a silicone-based sealant. So here you go with the mask and the naked adapters. And we got an average of 4.49 particles per liter over 90 tests. So as promised, you can see that we sealed both the plug and the adapter with a silicone-based caulking. We used the same DAR Medtronic filter, which is an excellent filter, which is a 99.97% rating, and we caulked the actual filter to the adapter. And here you can see the testing that we did with the same 6800 mask, and we got an average of 3.97 particles per liter over 90 trials. To give us a control, we actually compared the mask with a 2096 filter and tested the air going through it. And we got an average of 2.72 particles per liter over 90 trials. And to give us a comparison, we tested the air on the outside of the filters and mask. And we averaged 9,514 particles per liter over 90 trials. If you do some simple calculations with the 2096 filter, we got a 99.97 filtration efficiency, which is basically the theoretical max for this filter and mask. With the adapter and the DAR Medtronic filter, we got a 99.95% filtration efficiency. And with the adapter caulked, we got a 99.96% filtration efficiency. This filter adapter performs very, very well. And I think that if you print this adapter with a non-monofilament printer, you can probably reach that 99.97% filtration efficiency max. Kudos and two thumbs up to RSafe for a great design. It tests you great and you should be super proud. If you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe below. We could use the support. Talk to you later.